Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. I just want to brighten it a little bit. Yeah. All right, you guys, I got Good morning. What it comes out looking like, a perfect latte. Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. If you are new here, my name is Phoebe. Thank you so much for joining us. If you've been here, thank you so much for sticking around. This is my second vlog while I still get reacclimated to YouTube, but I'm excited because I've decided I'm gonna be doing weekend vlogs starting on Friday. So I just got back home from work. It is 5 p.m. on the dot and I'm exhausted. Um, it was a long work week. I was sleepy driving home and all that other stuff. But I think this weekend is gonna be exciting because it's Mother's Day weekend. So I'm gonna be seeing a few of my friends who got babies, my cousins who got babies, and then my mama, of course. Um, so I can't wait to take you guys along for a full weekend, a very full weekend. For right now, I'm about to take a nap, like a 45 minute nap, get up and get ready because my good, good girlfriend is visiting from New York and we are going out to dinner. So I'm gonna get up, take a quick shower, do a light beat, and then head out to go meet them. We're going to a Thai restaurant in Silver Spring. If you're from Maryland, yeah. Um, so yeah, but I hope you guys enjoy this vlog. Don't forget to subscribe if you have not already. And if you are subscribed, thank you again. I took a very short nap. I don't even think I napped. I had the TV on in the background and I think I was like low key watching what it is that was playing, but whatever. I am about to do a quick face um before i head out because we're supposed to be meeting up at 7 30 and it is currently 6 26 so i have a little over an hour but i don't want to be late because sasha is very punctual oh my god this sunscreen is this is the the glow sunscreen by super goop baby Okay. All right, I'm going to go in with some Milk Hydro Grit Primer. Um, so I don't have a makeup table yet, so I'm literally sitting on my planter and then I have the camera set up in front of like the window because the lighting is just really still good. So bear with me. Um, I just got this e.l.f. High Halo Glow Liquid Filter. This thing is amazing. I can use it alone and it looks like a, like a tint. Um, so I'm gonna use this today with a little bit of my foundation, just a little bit. So I'm recording a TikTok video at the same time, so bear with me. But these are the two that I'm going in with. My NARS foundation is like almost gone. Anyway, I'm gonna start with this. Okay. And then just a little bit of the NARS foundation. Just a little bit. Okay, I know I said a little. Okay. Y'all, I think I was deep cleaning my house and I threw away some of my makeup brushes. So I had to go pick up a new foundation brush. Sonia Kuchek. I think that's how you say her last name. That's one of my favorite foundation brushes. So I picked up a new one. Um... Okay. <clears throat> so what we're gonna do is just spray the brush. Because I am not trying to do like a heavy, heavy face, I did not color correct. Normally I would color correct, but I'm not trying to do like a serious beat, so no color correct. Just something really light, you know, it's not a full coverage, but enough to just cover some of my hyperpigmentation. I don't even know what I'm going to wear. That's why I wanted to do my makeup first, because at least if my face is done, I can decide what I want to wear. All right, I'm going to go in with my e.l.f. concealer. These ones are a little bit too light. This is in the color Chestnut and Cinnamon, and it's just too light. So I'm going to use a little bit of my NARS concealer in Amante, Amande, 
which is almost finished, but it's one of my favorite. So I'm gonna start with this and then I'm gonna brighten my under eyes with the e.l.f. concealer. For my nose, for my upper lip area, I'm going to use my favorite from my favorite concealer, LA Girl Pro Concealer. If it ain't broke, don't fix it. And this is not broke. All right, I really don't have a mirror, so I'm using my big mirror that I used to get dressed with. This is crazy. It's, it's so chaotic. But bear with me. All right, so we're gonna put on our conceit, our contour, a Black Radiance Color Perfect Foundation Stick. I use it for contour. I use it in a darker color. I lost the top, the back, so I can't tell you what color. And then we are going to go in with a brush to blend it out. Do I want to use this one? Yes, because I can't find my other one. So we're going to go in with this one. And again, I'm going to spray it with setting spray because I want my face to sit. All right, child, trying to record for TikTok. And I'm also recording this for Instagram, so. You guys are the best for sticking around if you stuck around. And because I haven't uploaded a makeup video on here so in so long, I feel like this would be a good, like, hey, I still do my makeup video, you know? No? Yeah? Gotta snatch that jawline, child. The glow in this, like, um, elf is so good. It, you, it just leaves you glowing, like, glowing. Let me see if I can turn down this filter a little bit. No. But y'all can see that glow, right? Y'all see that? I have to tame my edges because these braids are like seven weeks old. And if we know anything about braids, when you have natural hair, it doesn't last. Anyway. Okay. I know you guys can see that camera. <laughs> um, blend. Still glowing. Mm, 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 mm. All right, I'm gonna go in with the lighter e.l.f. color in chestnut, just right here. I just wanna brighten it a little bit since we're going out and it's gonna be nighttime. I just want it to be a little brighter under there and I haven't been sleeping enough still, so. This will help me look like I actually get some sleep. I'm gonna pull it up into my eyelids because I'm gonna add a little bit of color on my lids tonight. So my friend Sasha just had a baby, the one who's coming up in New York. So this is like her first getaway since she had her baby. I think he is either four or five months. He was born in December, so he should be turning five months this month. So this is like her first trip without the baby. Um, so yeah. We want to make sure that she has a little fun. I know Sasha's probably going to watch this and be like, beeps. <laughs> so fun fact about these, my two friends, I met them on Instagram. So my fitness page on Instagram, Breaking Up With Obesity. Um, we met each other on there because we were both doing keto. All three of us were doing keto and we just kind of bonded. My friend Mo lives in the DMV, but Sasha lived in New York. So after we all like became friends... We went up for Sasha's, or I went up for Sasha's graduation from physical therapy school because once upon a time, I was in school for physical therapy. Um, so I went up to New York for Sasha's 
graduation and we've just been great friends ever since. So yeah, I'm excited to see my good, good girl. I was just in New York last month for her baby shower. So it's gonna be, not last month, but I think it was either December or November for the baby shower. So it's gonna be fun to see her again. All right, to set my face, I am going to use a brush, not a sponge. But you know what? We're gonna use a sponge. Cause I feel like I really need to set my face, so. Okay. Child, I didn't show this for TikTok. Hold on one second, y'all. I just started putting my blush this close because apparently it's supposed to be on the apple of your cheeks. And I used to think the apples of your cheeks were like up here, but apparently it's over here. So, mm, whatever. Oh, this looks so good. This Rare Beauty blush is phenomenal, okay? I just want to say that it is just freaking amazing. It also adds a bit of glow. So if your goal is to like glow, this is perfect for summer because you will glow for the gods, honey. Glow for the gods. I'm about to top it off with the Rare Beauty um, Liquid Luminizer, baby. You can't say nothing. And then I'm going to use my fan brush to blend it out. Wow, oh, look at that glow. Do y'all see that? Do y'all see that? All right. Um, now we're going to top everything off, okay? We're going to go in with... Jeez. Ow. I'm going to go in with my Fenty Mocha Mommy. To warm up the face a little bit, even though it's technically still warm because of the. I forgot to do this for TikTok. Damn. Y'all, I'm trying, okay? I am really trying. I'm trying to create content for all my platforms, and it's like, girl, your, your memory just ain't there no more, sis. I know Sasha and Mo are not gonna be wearing makeup, but I've told myself that I'm gonna wear makeup when I go out because I just like looking good. You know, when you look good, you feel good. I'm gonna wear my makeup even if I'm the only one wearing makeup. Um, because why not? I don't care if my girlfriends are wearing makeup or not. Anyway, like I was saying, I don't care if my girlfriends are wearing makeup or not. I would wear I'm going to wear it because I want to look good. I want to feel good. So I'm going to wear it. Because again, why not? You know? And they always love when my face is beat. I just like the, the fact that my friends love when I beat my face because like they be hyping the hell up out of me. Those are good friends. Alright. So I'm not doing a full like i look i'm literally just doing my outer corners which is why you see me putting this there i am about to this is brush clean it's not clean y'all wash our brushes be better than me just just wash your brushes because now i'm struggling to find a brush to blend this out with it's embarrassing anyway but yeah that's my take in 2023 i'm gonna beat my face more and get dressed up more Okay, and then we are going to set this with a white um, shade before we add the color on top of it. If I can find a white shade. I was about to pull out my Juvia's palette. Juvia don't put no white in her stuff. Anyway. Bam. Morphe.
Okay, I think I'm going to do blue tonight because I'm wearing, I think I'm going to wear my denim skirt. So I'm going to just put a blue color on there. This is the Morphe times Matic, Maddie Ziegler palette. I absolutely love it. Oh my goodness. C can y'all see that? Oh my goodness. Y'all, I'm so glad my friend picked a restaurant that is not too far from where I live. <laughs> it's a good 25 minute drive without traffic. I love you, Mo. Thank you. All right, brow time. That's it for, that's it for your eyes. Like, you don't have to do too much. And you still look good. And you, like, I'm going to do my brows off camera and then come back. All right, brows are done. All right, I'm about to top it off with a little bit more highlight. And I'm going to use my Old Reliable. This is a Lorac Tantalizer. How do I still have it? I just do. Okay, I'm going to go wash my hands and find something to wear. All right, so I thought I was gonna wear my denim skirt, but I'm not gonna do that. Um, I'm gonna do some baggy jeans, and I have a halter top, if I can find it, that I'm gonna wear. What if I do baggy jeans, crop top, I feel like I'm always wearing a crop top though. Crop top and then some cute shoes. These tie. Let me set the camera back so you have to see the full. Okay. So these, my feet are not done, but I'm hoping people know how to mind their business. Because why are you standing on my feet anyway? I'm not your woman. Okay. This is this is an idea. Let's see how it looks. I hate it. This is not an idea. It doesn't look good with baggy jeans. That's, I don't really hate it. It just doesn't look good with baggy jeans. I wish I had like a pair of Doc Martens that I could throw on. I mean, a pair of um, Birkenstocks that I could throw on. All right, you guys. I don't know how much support this top has. Give me a second. So I'm gonna keep my bra on just so we see how much support this is willing to give me. Okay, wait, hold on. Head gotta go in first. Head, shoulders, knees, and toes. Oh, I got deodorant on. It's gonna mess it up. Okay. okay. I'm always late. Always late. It's so bad. And I don't wanna make excuses like I'm just a late person. No. Okay. Okay. Okay, it gets a little bit of support. I've... Damn it. Okay, I think I can take this off. This reminds me of being back in middle school. I used to hate getting undressed in front of the other girls. Okay. This doesn't look bad. This does not look bad. The tag is still on the shirt. <laughs> okay, all right. Let's turn around, full view. Now, should I just let it be like baggy or should I throw like, okay, I like this. I really like this, gotta pull the tits up. Okay, this looks good. And I'm probably not gonna put a belt with it just to give it the, the whole baggy effect, but I don't have a jacket to wear. Cause you know, I don't like showing my arms. Like my arms look good, but I don't like showing them. Um, shoes, shoes, these shoes. I do know that I'm gonna carry this bag, which means I'm probably gonna put on gold accessories with it. So I have no shoes, oh my God. I'm gonna have to wear sneakers with this. Yeah. Okay, I'm gonna turn you guys off, finish getting ready, and then turn you guys back on. I'll be right back. All right, so <clears throat> I totally forgot about my pandas. So I'm gonna do my pandas. 
and I'm just waiting for my lashes to dry. I'm already late. They're already headed there. I'm just going to be late so I at least look and feel good. I tried putting a belt on with these jeans and y'all it looks so terrible. So I'm just going to leave it as is. It makes my butt look soggy but whatever. I'm going for the whole baggy effect. Doesn't really work when you... It works. I'm going to leave it alone before I start talking about myself. But I look good. So yeah. And then gold accessories, gold bag. I don't know what jacket I'm going to wear because I don't want to. Oh, my leather jacket. We're done. We're done. I'm going to take some pictures and I'm going to catch up with you guys later. Peace. Look at the sign that they got for this little bar and grill. I couldn't find it. This little giant? This one right here. Oh, okay. I use number eight. Okay. Oh, it's a yeah. Stick. Yeah. yeah, it's a chunky stick really too. Knows. It is. It's so good. I bought two. Bags. I remember. I believe they're driving to oh, Y'all, it's a little, it's a little suspect, but we're willing to take it up. We are going to bless this meal before we eat it, right, girls? Yeah. yeah. And then we got bottled water just because you never know. <laughs> you gotta be careful out here. Coach had me doing 60 grams of car of carbs. Mm -hmm. I was going to ask you about your coach. Um, my fitness, the coach. I'm going to move the bottles of water for your... <laughs> 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 you took the fork away too. <laughs> Y'all saw she said, get the perfect, get the perfect picture. Yeah. All right, you guys, I got beef and shrimp curry. Mo got duck curry. Mm -hmm. And then Sasha got the fried rice. And it looks bomb as hell. It looks like party rice. You know, if you're African, party rice. Yeah. With shrimp and chicken y'all so i am in this random ass like side of the road because sasha remember we did not take a group picture so i had to like stop driving home and wait for them here and it's just like the middle of nowhere so i'm like watching my front my back my sides and everything else because i don't want somebody to roll up on me and like hurt me but i'm sitting over here waiting for these girls so that we could take a group picture because sasha wants a group picture y'all i'm scared Oh, we really came to a gas station to take pictures, y'all. But the lighting Ended. is perfect. Sure did. Show them, show, the the, show them the ring. Show them the ring. Show them the ring. Show them the ring. Bam. Look at that. Bam. <laughs> hey, y'all. So it is like 1242 at night. Um, I just came home a few minutes ago from having dinner with my girlfriends. And we had such a good time. It was good seeing Sasha and Mo. Um, so we left dinner and we were on our way home when Sasha realized we hadn't taken any pictures together. So we literally met up like at a random gas station. I pulled out my tripod that I keep in the car that I use at the gym and we took pictures at the gas station. I'm going to share them. They're so cute. Um, but it was just so funny. Like we were so dead serious about getting pictures. I am about to take my face off and get in bed because I have a long day tomorrow. Um, so I'm just going to share with you all how I take off my makeup and my evening skincare routine. Um, my outfit was cute. We were all kind of matching because we all kind of had black on. Mo and I both had black blue jeans and our pandas on so it was just so funny. Um, but overall, it was such a good night. I was so happy to see my girls. Great way to spend my Friday. Um, I don't know, just really, really fun. So I'm going to take this off, put on my night shirt, and then come wash this face off. off. I usually use my Clinique Take the Day Off Balm Cleansing Balm before I go in with a foaming cleanser. I love this stuff. It's so good. I then go in with my CeraVe Foaming Facial Cleanser. And I also wash my edges to get the gel off so I don't break out. I'm gonna go in with my Pixie Glycolic Acid. Just to exfoliate 
and hopefully reveal that I did a good job cleansing my skin. Because usually if you see makeup left on this, that's not a good thing. It means you didn't clean your skin properly. Now it does have a little tint to it, which would make you think you didn't clean your skin well because of the color. But all clean. One more. Make sure you wash your edges, y'all, because that's probably why you be breaking out on your hairline. I also clean my nose rings, so I don't have any makeup on them. Next up, we are going to go in with the Green Tea Complex and Chinese Skin Activating Smoothie Oil Solution. This is from Wish Trend. I love it. Some retinol because if you are not using retinol you're not trying to stay youthful my battery is about to die if and when it dies you guys I will see you in the a.m. um Tomorrow is my cleanup day, so I'm going to wake up, do my hour of cardio, and then clean. Um, before my battery dies, I'm going to go in with this Calming Moisture Nourishing Cream. Again, from Wish Trend. Actually, this is not from Wish Trend, but I'll link it down below because it's on my Amazon storefront. But that's all I do at nighttime. And I'm going to put some oil and leave-in conditioner on my edges just to moisturize them and lock in the moisture. But see you guys later. Okay, my battery hasn't died yet. I just wanna show you all what I use for my edges. I use the Myel Leave-In Conditioner and I use the Main Choice Growth Oil. I am trying to get my edges back and thick, especially this side. The knotless braids have been killing my edges, yet I still get them. Anyways, that is all for tonight. I will see you all tomorrow on Saturday. It technically is tomorrow, but I will see you guys after I wake up from sleep. Good morning, you guys. I don't know why I keep doing this. I, I'm not little baby. Anyways, good morning, guys. So, I woke up late. I woke up really late. It is currently 11.21. You guys like my Bernie? Anyway, it's 11.21. I was supposed to be up about like 7.30 because I had a lot to do in the morning. It's too late and we cannot look back. So, I am about to start cleaning because my house doesn't look horrible but i do clean on the weekend so i'm about to start cleaning and then i'm gonna take a break because i have to go to the mva and renew my tags my dad told me i cannot come to his house with expired tags anymore i've been riding dirty y'all so i'm gonna go quickly renew my tags and then come back because i'm going to my parents house tomorrow and i don't want to hear that man's mouth and i know i'm gonna hear his mouth so I'm gonna start cleaning. I'm gonna make some coffee first because I can't start the day without coffee. And then I'm gonna start cleaning. More than likely, I might start with the bathroom and some laundry because those are two of the places that just take me forever. And then take a break and run to the MBA because I can use the kiosk to renew my tags. Yes, I know. It's okay. I'm gonna do it. But anyways, good morning. Happy Saturday. Today is the 14th. The 13th, the day before Mother's Day. Today is May 13th. The month is flying. It's ridiculous. Why? Iced coffee. I love the Starbucks dark roast because it doesn't taste like watered down coffee. But it's so expensive. Inflation is so trash. And then we do a little sprinkle of heavy cream to top it off. When I was doing keto, I loved using heavy cream for my coffee, and I bought some the other day to cook with. Mm -mm. Looks a little weird. It's, it doesn't smell, but it looks weird. And because of that, we're gonna use some light heavy cream. You know, when anything smells weird or looks weird, you just it's better safe to not use it. Maybe I kept it too close to the door of the fridge. I don't know.
And then I'm going to top it off with a little sugar-free salted caramel syrup. And voila. This should not be the first thing I'm drinking, so let me get a bottle of water. You gotta be a responsible adult. First thing you should have in the morning is water. Ugh, it's a gloomy day, so my lighting is gonna be off again. Damn it. I feel like my body's like charged up. Thank you for the water. It's like, no. Every time I drink water fast, it hurts my stomach. I don't know why I just did that. Never learn. I never learn. All right, we've had our water. Now we can have a little bit of liquid gold. You know how breast milk is like liquid gold for babies? Coffee is liquid gold for adults. Like, you can't tell me it's not. It is. Let me check what's on the NBA clothes. Because I may have to go now instead of later. <clears throat> oh! They close in 30 minutes. I gotta go now. They close in 30 minutes. Oh my God. Okay. I am going to get there at 11.37. So... Y'all, I am racing for time. It is 11.34, they close at noon. Every light is like turning yellow. And I'm over here riding too fast in these neighborhoods with expired tags. All this, I can see my mama tomorrow because my dad told me I cannot come to his house <laughs> with my expired tags. You guys, I made it. I made it, I made it, I made it. Okay. Come on, y'all, hurry up. Hurry up, hurry up, hurry up, hurry up. I got like 20 minutes to spare. It's 11.37, I got, I got a little time. I just think it's so crazy that everybody wants to drive proper when they get to the NBA. Y'all would not driving like this back there. What is going on? Why all of a sudden do you wanna drive like this? Why? It's so annoying. There's so much parking, but they're so pressed to just, like, come on. Damn, it's parking right here. Y'all doing too much, too much. All right. All right, so I'm done cleaning. That is the bedroom. I left some of my shoes out because I have to record some content on cleaning my shoes. So I left some of them out, but once I'm done, I'm going to put them away. This is the living room, all cleaned as well. And then the kitchen. I have some um, candles burning just to help the house smell a little fresher. But I got rid of the shoes in the living room. And the bathroom is also clean as well. Love it. Love a clean home. Now, me, I have to figure out something to eat because all I had was some scrambled eggs and a piece of low carb toast. So I think I'm gonna hit up Grubhub because I don't feel like cooking and dirty in my kitchen. So I'm gonna order something from Grubhub and then probably go to the store and pick up the flowers that I wanna get for my mom and my cousins today because I know tomorrow's gonna be crazy and I wanna get down to her house early. Okay, and then also about the registration, it didn't happen. Um, long story short, I have a flag on my tag. I had to pay a parking fine for my school. I paid it and I cannot renew my tags until it hits the system. So possibly Monday. Yeah, I'm still going to my mom's house. I don't care. My dad is just going to have to be mad. So I am really, really hungry and I don't feel like cooking. But I'm about to leave the house to go pick up some flowers like I mentioned earlier. Y'all, why did I just make cookies in the air fryer? I put it at 325 degrees for about 13 minutes and it's good. Other than it being cracked, it came out really good. Is that lazy? Maybe. Or is it smart and convenient? Work smarter, not harder. 
All right, so this is what I picked up. I got flowers. This is gonna be for me, my siblings, and then that's my cousins. She sent me money. And I got some flowers from my house because I haven't gotten flowers since my allergies were acting up. So I'm gonna test this out and see if it doesn't bother me. And then I got a bunch of groceries because I am back on my diet starting Monday. So I just got some food that will hold me up. I'm doing a boot camp next week for work. Um, it's a boot camp for a certification that I really want. And I know because I'm going to be like in the boot camp, I want to be able to control what I'm eating, what I'm snacking on, especially when I get bored because the boot camp is like an eight hour boot camp for five days straight, y'all. So, yeah, this is all that I got. I spent too much today. But thankfully, I don't have to spend any money next week other than buying gas. And that's about it. If I go shopping next week, that's just stuff for the house maybe maybe stuff for my office because i still need a bookshelf i really really want a bookshelf um and then buying the nightstand that i've been looking at for my bedroom but other than that that's about it i'm about to put this groceries away actually i'm gonna re record some content for my fitness page because i gotta share what it is that i got with my grocery run and i'm gonna hop in the shower order some food sit my butt down and watch a good movie i think i'm gonna watch creed because it's available on prime for like $16, I'm going to pay for it because I really just want to chill and relax, you know, and then go to sleep early so I can wake up and do the cardio that I did not do today because today was just a really busy day for me and it's okay. Good morning, y'all. So I woke up maybe an hour ago and I had like this crazy pain on my toe. Um, I put gel, <clears throat> I do gel, L, gel X on my big toes just because I don't like the shape of my toenails or the look of it. So I put gel X on there just to make it a bit more appealing. And for some reason, my right toenail is hurting so bad. Now, they still look good, but I was like, it's hurting for a reason. Let me get up and take it off. So I got up, got my drill and I have been like drilling it down. I currently have one of those little toe thingamajigs with acetone on it to just get rid of the remaining gel that's lingering, but I don't know what's going on. I'm hoping it's just, maybe I hit my toe and I don't remember, but I feel like that's something you would remember. Anyway, I have a lot of laundry to fold. I'm about to fold it, quickly get ready and then head to my mom's house. Um, I want to get there early because today is the gym is gym day for me. I know it's Mother's Day, but we're not doing anything. I'm just going to go to her house, chill for a couple of hours, drop off her gifts. I'm going to stop by the liquor store and get her her favorite drink. It's disgusting, but she loves it. Um, it's called Campari. I'm, I'll share a picture, but y'all, the drink tastes like cough syrup. And my mom be crushing it. So I'm gonna stop at the liquor store and get her a bottle of that. Um, I'm just spoiling my girl. Um, I got her a card. I'm gonna slip some money in that and tell her to hide it from my dad because I know his nosy self is gonna be looking. So yeah. Um, so I'm gonna quickly fold this and then get dressed and then we can head over to her house to see my mama. She's so excited for Mother's Day. I absolutely love that for her. If I could support my mom every day, I would. So, yeah. Gotta work a little harder. But that's all. It's Sunday. You know, the week is, weekend is over. Thankfully, I'm off or I'm working from home all next week. Thank God. Um, so, it's going to be a super chill week. I'm excited for that. And, uh, yeah. That is all. So, let me finish folding this laundry like a good person that I am. This is laundry from last week. I have laundry in the dryer right now from yesterday. So, yeah, I'm trying. Don't judge me. It has to be a disease because why? Why? 
anyway, I'm so proud of myself. I vlogged this entire weekend. Um, still getting used to vlogging, still trying to figure out what matters, like what to share and stuff like that. But either way, I'm just happy because I did it. And I'm actually going to upload this one. Now, I vlogged last weekend, but it was all over the place. So I deleted it. And I deleted everything else that was on my memory card. Even the makeup videos that I recorded a couple of years ago, I deleted everything. I'm like, we're starting fresh. I'm a little upset, but it is what it is. Um, so yeah, I'm excited. I will see you guys in a little bit. I just want to handle this and get my living room in order because my house is clean and I need this to, yeah. So I took a break from folding. Because I want some coffee and I'm trying to decide if I want it iced or if I wanted hot coffee. But you know, when the weather changes, we all change how we drink our coffee. And honestly, I really just want a warm cup of coffee today. So it's a hot coffee kind of day. Um, this prevents me from like drinking too much cream. So if I add a little bit of sugar-free sweetener, the salted caramel, it prevents me from using too much cream. So if you're a super cream drinker, get a sweetener. You know, if you can stand the taste. Apparently it has an aftertaste. I don't taste it, but that's just me. I think my lips were dry and I felt like you guys were gonna look at it and be like, damn. So, but yeah, if you wanna drink like less creamer just put some sugar-free sweetener in your in your creamer and like whatever never mind because i can't get my words out straight it's no <sighs> this toe hurts so much i don't know if i'm gonna work out today <laughs> but it's gonna happen because sundays start the week for me it's gonna happen i'm probably just gonna have to wear some thick socks or no socks so I usually do this and then I brew my coffee on top of it and then I add the rest of it. Aesthetics. It's like no. But yeah, I don't know why my toes hurting. I need to book an appointment with my podiatrist anyways. Um, so maybe this is a sign that I should book the appointment. Maybe. I honestly wish the Nespresso was not so loud. Like, why are you so loud? Brewing some damn coffee. It's so funny when men text me Happy Mother's Day. I'm like, I'm not a mom. I ain't got no kids. Yes, I helped my mom take care of my siblings, but those are still not my kids. Whatever. I'm texting all my favorite people happy mother's day all right so this is what it comes out looking like a perfect latte it's perfect now i still have some um this is what happens when you add like some of the syrup in there you tend not to use too much cream which is good for people like myself who are dieting and trying to lose weight if you're not drink all the cream you want okay i'm here for it i love it anything else I feel like it's a little too bright <clears throat> but yeah I try to make up my bed every morning even if I don't do it immediately I always come back to do it and before I moved into my apartment I did not do this um, when I was still in my parents house I would get up and I would leave my bed as is and my dad would always tell me he was like you know when you make up your bed it just did it. I was just like, yeah, mm hmm. I hear you. And it would never like get done. But then I got to my own place and I'm just like, okay, I see what he meant. It does make a big difference. I hate when I get lint on my sheets, but there's no way to avoid it because of our clothes. But yeah, it's just, it's an eyesore. But yeah, my dad was right, you know? When you make up your bed, it just makes a difference, it makes a huge difference.
Um, some people will agree, some people won't. It's not really something that I want to debate with others. It's just for me personally, making up my bed in the morning has made a huge difference for me. Um, even if my house looks untidy elsewhere, at least I know I can come and look at my bed and it's just a reminder that you are not a messy person. Okay. And then my dad has this thing where we grew up. He always used to tell us cleanliness is next to godliness. So I feel like a clean environment is good for the soul, in my opinion. Let's find something to wear to the gym. I want to look cute. It's Mother's Day. I'm not a mother, but I still want to look cute. You know, because when you look good, you feel good. All right. So I've lost about 17, maybe 20 pounds since the year began. Um, for some, that's not a lot. But for me, having PCOS, that is a lot. So I try not to be inconsistent in some of the habits that I've picked up. Not really habits, but because I'm trying to make this into a lifestyle, so I'm not constantly losing and gaining the same 50 pounds over. I'm trying to make a lifestyle out of this process once and for all. So my schedule is Sunday through Thursday, Friday and Saturday are my rest days. And I take that very seriously because it took a while for me to get to a schedule that I'm very comfortable with. So I try not to interrupt it, which is why I'm like, I'm going to go to my mom's house. I'm going to spend time with her. And then by three o'clock, I'm going to be in the gym um, to do my workout. And my parents understand it because I've been doing this for years. They understand I love it. But some people are just like, oh, it's Mother's Day. Why can't you? First of all, my mom is practically going to be sleeping for the whole day because that's her favorite thing to do. Her favorite pastime is sleeping. So I'm not going to go sit at my parents' house and watch my mom sleep. And my mom, she might go out with her girlfriends. I don't know. But, you know, I feel like people think how their dynamic works with their family is how it should work with everyone's family. And my family is not the same. Like major holidays, we're not always with each other. Just past Christmas, I was not at home for Christmas. And it was fine. And everybody's like, oh my God, why aren't you at home for Christmas? It's okay, you know? So I just wanted to share that like, if you have a lifestyle and it doesn't fit everyone who's in your corner or in your life, it's okay. Because at the end of the day, you're loyal to you and you first and foremost. So if people look at you weird and they're just like, oh, it could never be me, that's fine. That is fine. That That's why it's me, not you. You know, so mm, that's my two cents. Even though I'm wearing a hoodie, I'm going to show my arms after my workout because my arms look good. Like, if my stomach could catch up, I'd be happy. But whatever. Deodorant. All right. I put on my fragrance oil to make my skin glow because my gym has some handsome black men. So, yeah. And, and I put on my favorite smell good. I just love how they combine together. So I usually mix the two of them. And voila, we're ready. I have some shoes in my car. Y'all, I have literally am building a booty. A nice shaped booty. I didn't have one, okay? God did not see me fit for a booty, you know? He was like, you know what? I'm gonna give you muscles and strength. I think we can hold off on the butt because he knows if I had a butt, my middle name will be Tatiana. like, no. <laughs> but no, seriously, God was like, yeah, let's not do that. That'd be too much. You know, we gave her boobs, we gave her muscles, we gave her strength. That's enough. That's enough giving. Let's, let's save some for her sister. But I'm going to build one in the butt. I'm building one. Okay? I'm building one. Yeah, yeah. Exactly. What was I saying? I was going to leave and not wash the dishes, but I just want to come back to a clean house. So I'm going to quick. Oh, it's not even 10 o'clock yet. My goal was to be out of the house by 10, um, 10 a.m. And it's only 944. So I'm actually doing really good on time. I'm going to quickly 
wash these dishes before I leave because I just want my house to stay clean. You know, after you spend hours cleaning, just the idea of your house being dirty again is very, it's very, I don't know the word, but it just sucks. So I'm gonna clean. washing dishes um but oh my tv says good morning um <laughs> i had five minutes to get ready and leave the house which is really really good um i'm not a fan of washing dishes i know for a fact the man that god blesses me with is going to like cleaning bathrooms and washing dishes because i don't so the compromise is i will cook you great food keep other areas of the house clean and clean our sneakers because we're going to be sneaker heads together all you have to do is wash your dishes and i don't mean in the dishwasher wash your dishes and clean the bathroom that's it that's all i'm asking for that's all lord okay let me show all right because i'm not going to be home i am going to put out my trash now Because it's the summertime and that's, oh my God. Them little shits have been pissing me off so much. So I'm going to put the trash out now. Because I don't want any more. I got like this organic bug spray. I'm hoping it works because... And that's just so annoying. And then it makes you feel dirty even if your room is clean. So, yeah.
take some of my books to study with because when I say my mom is going to probably be sleeping, she's probably going to be sleeping. So to keep myself entertained, I'm just going to read and do some practice questions while I'm there. You know? Productive. And then I'm going to take something for breakfast because I haven't had anything to eat yet. So I'm going to take some yogurt, two to be exact. And um, yeah, I can make some eggs at your house. So I should make some protein shake. I'll make some protein shake. There is no plant food in here. So I'm going to write down instructions. I think I'm going to mix some plant food in a bottle and put it in the fridge and have my mom just put it in the water after a couple of days because I don't know why Safeway wouldn't put extra plant food. Like, why, 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 would, why would you not do that? All the money that people are paying for flowers. Wow, okay. That's the least you could do, you know? So, I'm probably gonna make some, I hope they have all the stuff. Bleach, sugar, lemon juice. This is for my post-workout. Um, not for right now. What do I need? I need to fill up my water bottle. Mm -hmm. I have been struggling to drink my water, so what I've decided to do for the next week or so is just add a little bit of water enhancer to it, just to get me through the day. I don't know if I'm gonna carry all this stuff down into the garage. Wish me luck. All right. I'll see you guys in the car. Okay, we got out the house. I had to rest those down because my hand hurts. Of course, the cleaning lady is vacuuming the elevator. Why are you working on Sunday, on Mother's Day? I mean, I get it, we all gotta get our money. So I'm not mad at sis, but damn, I'm not taking the stairs. I'm not. I wait in like a million years. After waiting like a million years, we made it. I left my mom's house and I went to the gym for about two and a half hours. It was upper body day and I was just excited that my strength was still intact. Y'all, I look so good. Excuse the video and how it doesn't fit um, YouTube, but I look so good. Hey y'all, so I've been out pretty much all day. I went to my mother's house, I gave her her Mother's Day gift. Please ignore what it is that you see right here. I was washing my face because I just came back from the gym and I washed my face a little too hard and my nose ring fell out. So in order to prevent my nose piercing from closing up, I had to use some of the spare jewelry that I had in the house and <laughs> this is all that fit, so yeah. I don't know what I'm gonna do. I'm probably gonna go to a piercer tomorrow and see if they have any jewelry um, available for purchase and pick one up because this is hideous. Um, anyway, I am about to make a quick dinner, a salad with some chicken for extra protein and then chill and go to bed because I start my boot camp tomorrow. So yeah, but this is where I'm ending the vlog. Um, I hope you guys enjoyed it. It was a really short Sunday vlog so hopefully the rest makes it more interesting but yeah um my mama loved her stuff she was crying i reported it y'all gonna see her she's so dramatic she was crying because of the flowers i'm like girl we give you flowers every year even on your birthday do better but um yeah i'm about to have some dinner and call it a day Anyways, thank you for watching. Um, if you have been here, thank you so much for sticking around. And if you are new here, don't forget to subscribe. Don't forget to turn on your bell notifications. And I will see you in the next video. Peace.